What is up guys, it is Zombie King 76 here and welcome back to a brand new video. Today I am going to be showcasing off a brand new seed and uh, shout out to Vigilo. I'm sorry if I'm saying that long, wrong, excuse me. It's a V I L O R Y. Go check out his channel. Um, he's got a couple cool uh, seeds. Um, I figured I'll start off in the world, but we're not because I need to show you guys something quickly. But, um, <clears throat> here's the C guys right there. Uh, 432593336877169859 There's no way you guys can remember what I just said, but, um, pause the video screenshot or just pause the video and you guys can figure it out. But, um, yeah. So, the reason I started here is because I want to show you that when you go here you want to put in the seed but you want to have um i guess it doesn't really matter no amplified worlds well they haven't tried it with that <clears throat> but the bottom scale just leave it on small bonus chest and when we do world size normally it's on large but you want to change it to classic i've tried large uh i've not tried medium or small but classic is what seems to work and then you can load up the world um, but in this video, I'm not going to show you guys everything in this seed, but there is uh, 70 plus diamonds in this world. There is five villages, and there is seven mob spawners. <clears throat> so I'm going to show you guys, oh, there's also a, I believe three, was it? Three woodland mansions, so uh, yeah. Well, in the large version, there's three woodland mansions. Uh, the small there's only two But in this video, I'm only going to show you guys um, All the villages and in the next episode, I'm going to show you guys um, mob spawners and in the final episode the third episode. I'm going to show you guys <coughs> uh, All the diamonds so like I said for this one I'm going to show you guys the coordinates for all the villages we can also just follow my map. But to start off, let's just kill ourselves. Uh, was it keep inventory off? Oh, it was. Okay. I wanted to turn that off. Dun, 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 dun. Damn. Okay. <coughs> let's grab back our map and let's grab back the torch. So we're just keeping it off hand. So you spawn right here. And from the map, if you're looking, say that way's down, if you're looking straight on your map, which would be that way. So if you spawn in, you're looking at your map, you're looking at the, the Z, you want to turn to your left, all the way to the left, and you want to go straight. For not too long, and you should come across the village very soon. This village is actually on the edge of the world. Um, but you can see that little brown spot, it's right here, you can turn a little bit to the right. There's a big ravine here, now I have not uh, explored uh, these ravines at all, so you guys can go explore them for yourself. But, alright, quick note, every single village, there's five villages, every single village in this world has a blacksmith. Uh, now, I believe I've already taken everything from these blacksmiths. Yes, I have. But you end up getting a lot of things. So there's one from there. There's one village. And the other village... Okay, I really don't remember all the coordinates for these. <laughs> if I'm really going to be honest with you guys. Um, <clears throat> but in episode 2, I'll definitely have... The video up so I can m make sure I show you guys everything. And to be honest with you guys, at this moment, I really don't even know where the diamonds or the mouse spawners are because I haven't even looked at them. But, uh, so, the left side of the map and the top of the map is where we've been so far. This is the second village. This one also has a blacksmith, of course. We're not going to search the chest because nothing in there. <coughs> um, but there you go. This is the second village. Alright, well if you guys want to know really quick what, you, what you're going to get out of all these villages. What you're going to get is you're going to get a full set of iron armor. You're going to get two iron swords, one iron pickaxe, like four saddles, like, what was it, like 12 apples, diamond horse armor, and 
and what else do you get? Uh, you get a lot of tree saplings and stuff like that. But just right here where this village is, if you just keep going, you're gonna come across another um, <coughs> village right here. And I believe that's it for on the edge of the maps. The rest are kind of closer in. Um, over here about this desert, like I said, you guys can just follow me. Hold on, what is this? Is this lava? Or... No, there's a torch here. Okay, so this is actually where I looked earlier. I didn't explore the whole cave, just like right over there. Right over there. Um, there should be one over here. Yes, there we go. I believe this is the biggest village in the mall. So that's four villages. That I've showed you guys so far, right? Correct? Yeah. Of course there's something in there, but I believe this is the biggest one. It's also next to the Woodland Mansion, so that's really good. There's one more. That's four villages. Where's the other village at? Uh, da -da -da -da. We've been all around the edges. It's around here somewhere. Maybe there is only four. I thought there was five. Maybe there's only four. My bad. Um. Yep, looks like there may only be four. Oh, wait, have we? Yep, yeah, we've been in this one. We've been in this one. I don't know where it's going to be. Okay, guys. Well, this is going to be a really short video because it's just showing you guys four villages. I There may not be a fifth village, so uh, I don't really know. I'm not going to keep searching for hours and hours, but I wouldn't take probably hours. Um, like I said, a real short video. I'm just going to end it here because we found four villages. And wait. We, yep, yeah, we've been in this one. We have been to this one. Oh, I actually see the mine shaft over here. Looks like it might connect to this little cave right here. Nope. <laughs> that goes nowhere. It looks like it's inside of this cave. You know what, guys? You know what? You know what? We're doing something. Explode! We're getting in this mountain one way or another. This is the best kind of mining and I love doing this mining. Watch this. Alright, let's go in the mountain a little bit more. You just want to go all the way down. Might actually come across it. I say it's a mine shaft, I don't actually think it's mine shaft. And I do hear a zombie. And some skeletons. Oh look at here, we actually ran into a cave. Anything interesting? Doesn't look like it. So we're gonna keep going. But what you do is you. Oh wow! Look at their diamonds. Wow. Okay, we found some diamonds. I'll show you guys the coordinates for this. Let's see how many we got. Just this many diamonds. All right, well, there's three diamonds, guys. Enough to make yourself a pickaxe. There's the coordinates. Here, you know what? We're going to stand right on top of the middle one right here. X minus 87, Y4, and Z221. So just dig down, and you will find yourself some diamonds. Now, unfortunately, we're going to have to blow these diamonds up. I know. It sucks. But don't worry. You guys are probably thinking, well, what about for, next, for the third episode when you show us where the diamonds are? Don't worry, we're gonna have to load up a new world anyway. Because I kind of want to show you guys what's in the villages. Alright, so what you do though, is you fill this up with TNT. You can really go up too if you want. You can go all the way up to the top of the mountain. And you come up here, and then you explode. Exploding TNT! There's definitely a mine shaft down here though somewhere. Fine. We're gonna keep exploding. Oh look there! We found emeralds. Nice. You guys want another coordinates for emeralds? Here you go. Uh X eighty three Y eight uh Z tw uh two twenty two two twenty. Swear there's a mine shaft. I know there was, I saw it. 
Well, we're not gonna go too in detail. I don't know how there's a slime ball over here, but there is a lot of gold. A lot of gold. Uh, I found another one of these. Okay. Yeah, we're not gonna go exploring the entire place. Let's mine up and get out of here. So, yeah. I'm saving the rest. Ooh, hold up. Let's explore here quickly. Super quickly. No, don't say nothing here either. Once the next episode, we will uh, find everything else. Did we start digging, or is this it right here? I believe this is it right here. Oops. All right, let's get on out of here. Boom! There we go. Okay, so there may be only four villages. I'm super sorry about that, guys. <clears throat> My bad. I said five villages. May only be four. Well, there may be five, but uh, we didn't find that fifth village. And before next episode, we're gonna explore a little bit. And if I find it, then we'll start off showing you guys the fifth village. But y you know what? We we just gotta do something real quick, guys. We gotta do something. We gotta put in the seed. All right. We got we gotta put in the new seed. Cause I want to show you guys what's in these villages. All right. We're gonna name this new world. Uh. XP farm survival world. Uh, seed, it should come up. There we go. I have the seed saved, but there's the seed. Bonus chest. Classic host privileges. Let's start it up. Let's go over here. We might just kind of fill up the entire map. Well, before next episode, I'll definitely fill up the map. We won't do that just in this episode. So it should be right over here. Uh, we haven't came. Oh, here it is, right here. So, like I said, all villages, as you guys saw, have blacksmiths. So, in this one, you find seven obsidian, the helmet, and the saddle. So we're, we'll go, we'll put on the helmet put this there all right let's move on to the next one which is right over here I'm gonna see if I can remember all the locations for these villagers should be right over here keep going around here it's the top of the map I forgot that one's on the left side of the map this one's on the very top we should run into it any second like three two one hey look at that perfect timing so I'm not gonna break the building because we may come back. Alright, in this one we should see the pants. The pants? Nothing, okay. Uh, I don't remember this one having anything. Well, we got some apples, we got some saplings, and we got some iron. Alright, let's move on to the next village, which should be right in this direction. Right, 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 right. We should be right. Hopefully, we're right. I don't want to be wrong. Yeah, but I tried this on large and I just kept going and kept going towards that direction for about, I don't know, three minutes. <laughs> Which you probably think of three minutes, that's not a long time. But when you're flying, three minutes is actually quite a long time. You can get very far in three minutes. I'm going to get one side of the map to the other side of the map, probably takes 30 seconds. That's half of a minute. No, 30 seconds. In my well, yeah, yeah, it is. <laughs> Lost my mind today. <clears throat> so in half a minute, you can get from uh, one end of the map to the other end of the map in 30 seconds. So, Okay. <clears throat> okay. We've explored the edges. Now, I know there is one towards the middle over here. Because it's right next to the woodland mansion. We should see it in three, two, one. There's a woodland mansion. Where's the village? There she is. Alright, so this is the one, two, the third village. There should be one more somewhere. This is where you find the chest plate. 
The swords. The saddles and the pickaxe. So maybe there there has to be five villages. Because we found that's the third village and we've only got a chest plate and a helmet, so we're gonna have to have two more. So that means there would have to be five, but I have no idea where this fifth village is. No idea. No idea at all. Let's go up. 200. There we go. Oh, we can see a lot. Now we're just going to go around. Not the edges of the map, because we've already been to the edges of the map. We're going to go through the parts that we have not explored, because, I mean, if we've already went to where we've explored, uh, I don't think there's going to be another one there. Actually, no, there should be one right over here. If we keep going over here. Oh, this keeps going towards that other village. I'm going to the same places. Let's just fill in the map. Sorry, guys, that should only be three villages, right? One, two, three. Yeah, that is only three. There's one missing somewhere. There's a village missing. That's the one that we've already been to. So that's, I know three villages. And because the Savannah one, the one that we passed, the one we just passed, so that's three. Probably thinking, wait, you just said the same one twice. No, the one over there, the one there, and the one here. That's three. So there's one somewhere over here in this little pizza shaped on our map that we have not explored. So there's one over here somewhere. Because I know there's more than three villages for sure. There may not be five, but I know there's more than three. That is. Hey, here we go. Here's the fourth one. Well, I didn't show you guys this one earlier, did I? So this one would have been the fifth one. Here's where you get the boots. So there's one more where you get the pants. Because I didn't build the pants. So there is the fifth one that we were missing earlier, which is right here on the map. So there's got to be one right over here then. And I... I think I do remember one being over here, if I'm correct. There has to be, because there is no village. Okay, so there is only four villages confirmed. We just explored this entire map uh, around the edges of the map. We're going to explore this little tiny bit right here. There we go. We've explored this entire map, and did we not find only four villages? So I just showed you guys all the locations. All the villagers, or the villages, what you get, but I don't know where I got the pants from. Because I did not build the pants. Maybe, maybe one of the chests gave me a chest plate or boots and a leggings, and this time I just didn't get that. I don't know. But uh, there you guys go. We'll say, we'll still say five villages. Maybe there's one here somewhere that we didn't find that's hidden. I'll go back and watch the video. Oh, here it is. This is the fifth one right here. We didn't explore this one. So there you go, guys. All five villages. This one's going to give us the pants. There is five villages. Yep, there we go. We found it. The one corner that we did not check, because it was so small, I figured there'd be nothing up here. The one corner. All right, so there you guys go. All five villages. And it looks like there's only one woodland mansion on here. The large one, though, has two and this one to make three but well there's probably more in the <coughs> a large only covered two on there and it was like right here at spawn but there you guys go i'm not going to explore anything in the world uh that's going to be when we actually do a series on this um i kind of want to take this stuff back now i probably shouldn't have grabbed it <laughs> but this is what you end up with right here um, like I said, we haven't got any of the diamonds yet, and we haven't got, uh, any of that stuff. Uh, the spawners. I'm telling you guys right now, I am definitely going to want to stay next to a spawner. Hopefully they're all kind of close together, because I really want to have a skeleton farm. Skeleton spawner, because we can get, um, bows and stuff from skeletons. And you guys know I love bows. Recently, I've been using a lot of bows and arrows. I'm going to get tons of arrows. And if we can ever find that mine shaft, 
uh, what, that we were trying to find earlier and maybe get a looting three sword that would be absolutely amazing the best of luck because then we can get more bows and more arrows from those skeletons and maybe a zombie one as well a zombie spawner would be nice good for XP and good for rotten flesh and uh, hopefully there's a village nearby one of those as well so we can trade the rotten flesh with one of the villagers and get a lot of emeralds uh, also I don't know a witch you, you don't normally see a lot of witch spawners um what kind of spawners do you normally see technically the easiest spawner to find is the blaze spawner I think right because I mean I can just build a nether portal uh nether portal oops I think that's gonna die. kill us yep we died <laughs> well we lost everything <laughs> That sucks. But there you guys go. I should probably put keep inventory on. And there you go. But do we? Oh, I think so. Did we die there? But anyway, I hope you guys did enjoy. If you guys did, don't forget to smash that like button because it helps out the channel a lot. And if you guys did enjoy, what? Excuse me, repeating the same thing again. Um. Excuse me, just burped as well. Let's start back from the beginning. Hit that like, m hit that like button, guys, because it helps out the channel a lot. And if you are new to the channel and you like what you saw today, hit that subscribe button. And I will see you guys in the next video. Peace out.